Betta fish are among the most popular and beautiful pet fish in the world, but that wasn't always so. The genus Betta contains more than 73 recognized species, but the fish most people are familiar with is Betta splendens, or Siamese fighting fish. Wild Betta fish are dull grayish green with short fins, nothing like the spectacularly colored, long finned beauties of today. Through selective breeding, a wide range of colors and fin types have been developed, including, veil tail, delta tail, hoof moon, crown tail, double tail and mitt. Better keeping began in Thailand, formerly Siam, over 150 years ago. Children collected these territorial fish in rice paddies and would place them together to watch them spar, hence the name Siamese fighting fish. Soon, betting on these contests became commonplace. The King of Siam recognized their popularity and decided to regulate and tax them. In 1840, the king gave some fish to a man who, in turn, gave them to Danish physician, Dr. Theodore Cantor. The doctor bred and studied them, later writing a scientific paper that identified them as Macropotus pugnax. When it was discovered that there already was a fish by that name, Charles Tate Regan renamed them Betta Splendens, meaning beautiful warrior, a name that stands to this day. Bettas were first imported into France and Germany in the 1890s, and Mr. Frank Locke of San Francisco, California, brought the first Bettas into the United States in 19... Americans sometimes mispronounce the name as Beta after the second letter in the Greek alphabet, however, it is believed that these fish were actually named after the ancient Asian Beta warrior tribe, pronounced Beta. In Thailand, they are called Plikai.